But why aren't they being held accountable? Whose job is it to hold accountable for that state? It's the Public Service Commission doesn't have the power to um, enforce that. They have a lot of power, but you remember that there was a Wall Street business in the AJC that one of the commissioners got 91% of his campaign funds from proxies to the power. So, I mean, the same commission yeah. stood up in front of Congress and testified it was too cloudy in Georgia and so Yeah, well, I know, so this is a big problem that, that we have, and that they're not being held accountable. That's changed. You know. yeah, what you saw was us change that. Yeah. And I can tell you the story of how that change came about. Very touching story, but it happened, and we saw it, and we and we pressed the advantage. So we did this quietly, outside of Georgia Solar Energy Association. What had to happen? What had to be kind of very up close and personal, and the, the trust and the faith between the men. And ultimately, you saw what came out of it. Is three men decided, and, and that really you should contact Tim Evans and Doug Everett, and Mr. Bob and all of them. I mean, they did what was right. That was really, you know, was made me feel good to see them to, to, to recognize that there was there was another plan. Somebody was doing something they weren't supposed to be doing. Somebody came up with an answer for it. I said, well, let's throw it out there. Somebody 